guys, just got to the studio and going to be uh, recording part two of Drum Lab. We're at Progressive. It's in E-Town and they have students coming in tonight to record some drums and things. Okay. I'm is drumming. It, is there going to be someone singing or like, is it just... We're playing a couple of Beatles songs. Okay. We're playing Hey Jude and Let It Be. All right, guys. So at the Drum Lab now, inside the recording studio going to be um, checking out and seeing what they're doing here. Just in case. Now everybody has on their track sheet is like updated and you see that we are doing something that I say I never do, which is record things in stereo. Okay? But we are taking the piano into the recorder in stereo and there is a reason for it. <laughs> and the reason for that is at the beginning of Let It Be the only instrument that plays is the piano, so I have to occupy all of the acoustic space of the entire record just with the piano. If I have a mono piano, that's going to be a snooze fest the whole way through the first verse of Let It Be. But with it in stereo, we can very subtly set that in motion. Tom's playing and he'll be fine, and I'm singing and I'll run away with it. Okay. So I need you to keep... So from the top too. Yes. All right, so while they're setting up, I say let's get some coffee. <laughs> well, looks like we're drinking our coffee black. So I'm here with Joe at Progressive Studio. He's the owner. Just tell me a little bit about, like, you know, your studio and... Well, I'm Joe Trojak, and this is Progressive Enterprises Sound Studios. And uh, right now we're talking to you in the Atomic Porch Studio. This is a studio we built back in 1988. Um, it has done lots and lots of dialogue editing over the years. Um, a lot of it used to be on the old reel-to-reel -reel decks, and that's how I got the nickname Captain Razorblade, your superhero. When the music stops, inhale, exhale twice, then stop. And then tell me that you stopped. All right, this is Hey Jude, take one, locate zero, we are rolling. Um, editing today is much, much easier, but back in the day, um, we could easily say with duplication, there was well over probably one to two million cassettes that had their source in this room when we used to do Investors Hotline and then we did the Real Estate Cyberspace Society's internet radio show. What's Tom saying? Tom needs his more of the piano and a little less of me in his headphones. This is take one again, okay? Take one again, rolling. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. With the main studio, um, the Hack Labs are back once again. We're always happy to have them. I'm an 82 graduate of Hack. So it means a lot to see the students coming in. Um, a lot of them are my own students that I teach at Hack, so it's always neat to see them. I'm gonna go play bass. I'm gonna play this time. Okay. Okay, give me a oh, minute. Oh, and you have the right notes? That's uh, unlikely. But they were all saying how happy you look when you're playing drums. They're like, look how happy Aww, she looks when she plays. That's so sweet. They're right. Lately, we have a band called Driver. Um, and they've been tracking basics for an upcoming album. Um, Six Bar Breaks new album is coming out very, very shortly. That was tracked here back in January. And Byron Linder will be tracking his album here in July. And I'm still working on my next album, Liquid Voltage. And uh, we hope to have more progress done with that this summer too. I've never played this song before, <laughs> ever. <laughs> but I can read. David still did the acoustic designs of our main two rooms, the big room where we track drums and the band, and the control room, which was important. A lot of people don't take the time to acoustically treat their control room. Go to progressivestudios.com. You can also find us on Facebook at Progressive Studios. 
and um, you know, send us an email. Check out what we're doing. You can listen. Um, also, take note: we are releasing now what we call progressive beats. Um, a lot of the beats are ready if you're a hip hop artist to use, but they're also ready for a lot of commercial, film, and other applications as well. And there's ways we could quickly customize them to help you. And I was just really happy with the team we got doing that. It's going to be really exciting. Thank you.